inspire you for just a moment? Looked really controlled, uh, especially going into that last lap. Talk a little bit about your positioning in the race and how things played out leading into the final lap. Yeah, I, I would hope a 4.23 would feel pretty easy, but you know, that first round is like, there's a lot of nerves and, and, and you're just anxious and you just want to get out there and get one under your belt. Uh, get a feel for the track, get a feel for the crowd and the environment. Um, you know, it's a little bit different this year. We don't get that rest day. We're coming right back tomorrow. Sure. So a lot of it is about conserving more energy. And, and, and you know, that last lap I was really happy with, I felt really comfortable. At the end, you know, I, I saw people really going wide, so I didn't want to let them too much because there could have been six women right beside me. So, you know, it's just about, always, always for me, it's not about, I don't want to be the last qualifier. I always want to be in the top three because that's what it's going to take to make the team and to get on the podium at the end of the day. Thank you. I think a lot. Sure, you know, um, I think just managing emotions um, of a whole event, it's really exciting and nerve wracking. Um, I kind of know how to deal with that, I know how to do the rounds. You know, you can do it in practice all you want, but actually doing it, I think, is um, something a little different. So, yeah, being 31, I think I deserve to have some veteran experience under my belt. <laughs> Do you think it's silly at all to have at least three races to eliminate like two or three people? Um, I honestly don't. I think that's right. what the Olympics are like. And I think for anyone going to the Olympics or World Championships, it's important to know what that feels like running the rounds. So um, in that sense, it's a practice for the next level. Do you think they should maybe have had a few people in the field though and they make it up to like, 40 or something? Um, sure. You know, it'd always be nice to fill out the field. You know, I was just it'd be nice if, you know, USATF maybe um, had um, a clause where if people dropped out, if people paid their own way out here and they were here, then fill them in at the last minute. But um, at the end of the day, for those people that are here, you know, I hope they enjoy it. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm going to go cool down because it's just 